Hi guys, welcome to Kara's Corner. It is almost Halloween and I love Halloween. It's one of my absolute all-time favorite holidays. It's so fun, you can't go wrong, there's no expectations and it's just, it's just a blast. I absolutely love it. And I usually have a um, Halloween party, a huge Halloween party every year and as the kids have gotten older, we've done all kinds of different Halloween costumes. And because I host such a big Halloween party, I have to keep my costumes to where I can move around and host and open doors and serve food. So my costumes have to be rather simple. So I wanted to show you some quick Halloween um, ideas for um, for you if you're looking if you're going to an adult party or you're just dressing up and need a costume idea um, because these are pretty easy and they're quick and they're just simple to move and and you know uh, they're just comfortable basically. So my first one that I did, and I'll post the pictures up here so you can see. Um, the first one I did is the Bloody Chef. These are just some of my favorites. Um, the Bloody Chef, I had just the apron and the hat, the chef hat, and I had a knife, and I had fake blood. And that was pretty much it. I ordered it all from Amazon, and I mean the whole costume probably cost me less than $30. So. It was just an easy, I just wore a black underneath. I think I had a black shirt on and some leggings and put the apron on. And I took it outside and I just splattered it with the uh, fake uh, blood and there was my costume. So it was easy, it was fun, and I think everybody enjoyed it. My next one was a mummy's outfit. And our whole family dressed up as mummies and it was so fun and it was so comfortable. It was like wearing pajamas and um, it was just one of my favorite costumes. It was a little bit more pricey. I had ordered it from um, Chasing Fireflies. And if you've never heard of Chasing Fireflies, they have amazing uh, costumes for children, babies, adults, everybody. But they're a little bit on the pricey side, but oh my goodness, the, the quality is outstanding. It's not like your typical Halloween costumes where you run out and they're ripping and you know holes in it already. They'll last you for years and years. I've boxed mine up and we're going to use them for all different kinds of different things. So I'll put the link below and if you've never checked out uh, Chasing Fireflies you might want to you might want to check it out. Um, but the mummy's outfit was so much fun and we enjoyed it and it was comfortable. My next one was a ghost and I had ordered the ghost from um, Chasing Fireflies as well. And uh, it was a little bit harder because I had to trim the bottom of it because it was so long I couldn't hardly walk. But um, when, once I trim, trimmed like the tool, then it was good to go. Now, um, this would be a very simple costume to make if you are crafty because literally the whole thing was just tulle and then it had a satin ribbon tied around it to where I just tied it like this and that was it. So it was just massive tulle everywhere. Um, so it would be a really easy one to make if you didn't want to buy it. And I had ordered that one also from Chasing Fireflies and the link is below. And my next one was Cruella de Vil. And Cruella de Vil was such a fun costume because literally the only thing I had was a wig. That's the only thing I bought. And I think I picked it up at a local Halloween shop. Otherwise, I had on my black loft dress, old. I mean, it's, it's old, probably five years old, five to seven years old. Um, I had wore my wedding gloves that I wore in my wedding. And then I um, borrowed a friend of mine's has a daughter and she had a little stuffed dog, a little Dalmatian dog. So I borrowed one of those and the leggings were mine. So literally the only thing I had to buy that year was the wig and it was easy, comfortable. And besides the wig, that was the only thing I had to purchase. My next one was Alice in Wonderland and Alice in Wonderland is probably one of my favorites because it fit me so well. I had ordered it um, from a, actually no, I got it from a local Halloween shop. Um, it opens up, you know, around this time of year. Um, it's so easy. It was a dress and it had an apron over it. And other than that, I wore my own tights and my own shoes and that was it. So uh, it was so easy and so comfortable. So it's one of my favorites. 
Uh, the last one was Wilma Flintstone, and Wilma was just an easy costume. I had ordered it from Amazon. It was cold that night, so I had put on, because it, you know, kind of goes diagonal, and I was showing so much skin, I wanted to be comfortable and not feel like every time I bent down, you know, I needed to expose myself, so... I wore a long sleeve white tight t-shirt underneath it and it worked out great. Um, I had ordered it from Amazon and um, the I, I wore some black leggings underneath it because it was cold. But those are just some easy ideas. I thought I'd share them with you. Um, if you have um, any questions or comments, please make sure that you uh, comment below. And don't for forget to subscribe because it helps me and I appreciate it. Um, but until then, I will see you on the next video.